For this game, you'll need a pack of playing cards. We, you need to take out the picture cards, which are the Jack, Kings and Queens. They're not part of this game, so take them out. Give your cards a shuffle and then put the stack over on the side. You can play this game with two people. I've got myself and Sophie playing today, or you can just play it on your own. Once you've got your stack of cards, lay out or turn over and lay out six cards in a row. And then you take it in turns to make ten with the cards that are in front of you. We've left the jokers in as a free card. You can decide for that to be any number you like. I'm going to go first, Sophie. You can pick between two and four cards to equal ten. You need to say your maths thinking as you're doing it. I'm going to choose six plus four is 10, so then I keep those cards and fill up the spaces that I just uh, made. Now it's your turn, Sophie. Do five plus five. Show them to the camera. Five and five are 10. She turns them over and keeps them in a pile and then fills up the spaces again. It's my turn. I'm gonna do eight and two, make 10 and keep that as a stack. Don't put all your stacks, your pairs, or sets of three or four cards together because in the end, we count how many uh, combinations you ended up with. And then I'll fill up the spaces. I'm just gonna take 10. Well, no, because we said that you have to have a combination of between two and four cards. I'll go eight and I'll make the joker two. Yep, perfect. For demonstration purposes this time around, you just you continue with the until all the cards are finished. At the end you count up who's got the most sets. For demonstration purposes, if I'm looking at this and I can't do anything, of course I would be able to because the joker is anything. But if I couldn't do anything, then what happens is, if it's your turn, you just choose a card to take out of the combination, put it underneath the stack and replace it, and you miss a turn. Then the turn goes back over to Sophie. So it's your turn, Sophie. Joker and two. The so, joker will be eight. Right, so the joker's eight and two. Then it's back. Oh, sorry. It's back to my turn. I'm going to do. Ooh, can I do anything? See, it starts to get a little bit tricky. I can do six and one is seven plus two is nine. You can do six. I can and do six, six plus six. Oh, thanks, so. Six plus six, and then take away, makes 12, then take away two, gives me 10. Thanks, Sophie. And then I fill up those spaces. So just keep going until you've finished the stack of cards and find out who the winner is.